and praise the Lord. A very warm welcome to our on-screen announcements. Today being the 25th of February, 2024, the year of threshing the mountains. It is my joy and honor to be the host for today. My name is Waiderero Wakemani Namodoni. Karibu nisana. Hospital visitation is back. The hospital visitation ministry will be at the Mathare Teaching and Referral Hospital today. The bus leaves the main campus at exactly 1 p.m. And if you're coming in from the Shiloh Worship Center, the bus will pick you at Ketia Supermarket Mirema at exactly 1.10 p.m. To partner with us, you can use the M-Pesa pay bill 864231. The account is hospital visitation. God bless you as you purpose to plug in. Soko Sunday is here with us and it will be going down on the 3rd of March 2024 at both of our campuses. And the rates for our exhibitors are as follows. 500 Kenyan shillings for a table, 2,000 Kenyan shillings for a space with your own tent and 3,500 Kenyan shillings if you use our tent. To book, make payments to our pay bill number 864231 and account number being Soko Sunday. Please note to send the confirmation message to the numbers on your screen stating where you'd like to exhibit either the main campus or the Shiloh Worship Center or both our campuses. The Father's Vision season is back. If you've been looking to join the Father's Vision, then this announcement is for you. We shall be having our Bolts and Nuts seminar happening on the 29th and 30th of March 2024. The venue shall be the DCIKZ main campus and charges are 1,500 shillings only. To register, please do so in your networks or with any of our pastors. Karibuni sana. We have some exciting news for you for the month of March. Shiloh Worship Center, he, imagine me, Yenu, from the 4th of March 2024, we shall be launching Monday prayers at Shiloh Worship Center. Yes, you had me right. Please say the date, 4th of March, the bishop shall be coming to launch Monday prayers at Shiloh Worship Center. Time, 6 p.m. to 7 p.m. Please tell a friend to tell a friend, Karibuni Tuwombe Pamoja. Do you have play mats, carpets, or even assorted toys that are friendly to a child that is below the age of three? Then this message is for you. We are currently in the process of creating a mother's room at Shiloh Worship Center. To plug in, you can do so through the donation boxes that shall be available at the main campus and at Shiloh Worship Center, or through the pay bill number 864231 account is mother's room. All are welcome to plug in to the future of DCIKZ. Here at DCIKZ, we care about your spiritual well-being. That is why we have a team of dedicated pastors who are always ready to cater and attend to your spiritual needs. To meet any of our pastors, feel free to reach out to them via the numbers on your screen. We also have professional counseling that is available to all of us at no cost. To book an appointment, visit the church office or you can contact the numbers on your screen. Here at DCIKZ, we care about you. We have branded merchandise bearing the theme of the year, threshing the mountains. We have hoodies going for 2,500 Kenyan shillings, t-shirts going for 700 Kenyan shillings, and stickers going for 100 Kenyan shillings. To order, please text the number on your screen indicating your size and color of your preferred merchandise. Ladies, 
these ladies kwa kweli Yesu ametufanya tungare because the ladies conference 2024 is here with us wanadada kwa kweli hii ni getu and the grand opening will be happening this Wednesday from 6 p.m. all through to 8 p.m. right here at DCIKZ main campus and on Thursday and Friday we all gather here from 9 a.m. all through to 8 p.m. for an amazing time not forgetting Saturday we shall be having the DOI fun day a beautiful day of fun activities laughter and fellowship with our fellow sisters now to register please pass by the desk outside or do so on the link that is on the screen or available in our networks the fun day charges are only a hundred bob which you can also pay at the desk outside if you wish to sponsor a sister for the fun day sponsor several sisters for the fun day you're welcome to do so as well on the desk outside by the way wanandugu hatujawasahau every revival session every evening is open to all so all of you are really 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 welcome now next sunday which is the 3rd of march all ladies will be gathered at the DCIKZ main campus from 2 p.m. to 5 p.m. as we bring the ladies conference third edition to a glorious close now the speaker will be reverend Alice Kimani and she will just be polishing up on the theme powerful instruments aligned to purpose you cannot afford to miss this as we bring the ladies conference that edition to a close karibu sana hi wiki ni wanadada i pray that you don't miss out plug in if you can support a sister if you can karibu ni nyote let's fellowship together Are you looking for daily encouragement, uplifting messages, or even to catch up on one of our sermons? We at DCKZ are social. You can find us on Facebook at Deliverance Church International Kasarani Zimaman, on YouTube at Deliverance Church Zimaman, on X at DC Zima, and on Instagram at DCIK underscore Z. We know you're busy, and perhaps you'd like to listen to us on the go. We are on Spotify and Podbean. Karibu ni sana, plug in. One of the greatest joys of being a member of the DCIKZ family is that we have a father. A very happy belated birthday to you Bishop Dr. Jimmy Kemani. We are so honored to call you our spiritual covering and our father. We can only pray that with long life that the Lord shall satisfy you and perfect everything that concerns you. The DCIKZ family loves you. The media team, we love you. And even as the Kemanis, we love you. Well that has been my time and until we meet again with the Lord keeping us my name is Waidero Wakemani Namodoni see you on Wednesday for the ladies conference grand opening shalom If you read towards the end of the book of Ruth wow the scene scene four was a different scene they entered asking that they she be called Mara when they are adding up you would think Naomi was the mother She is the one who was leading the ladies of the village in celebrating. I pray that you will be the leader of celebrations because you have gotten your purpose and you know you have gotten it and you know you are not assumable. Let me tell you. Ruth was from Moab. Today we are talking about her. It doesn't matter which village you come from. It doesn't matter whether what status they tell you you are. When you have gotten your purpose It will sustain you in that place of work. It will sustain in that family. It will sustain you in that business. It doesn't matter who is competing with you. Your purpose will sustain you there.